Jamal Myers here with the legendary Noel Gallagher. What an honour it is to speak to you. Um, Thank you very much. What did you make of that fight? It was absolute chaos from start to finish. It was a great night. Um, from straight from the first round, it was great, and uh, I think it was. The, I think I think the referee was right to stop it when he did. I think I think Carl was going to get bashed up if he hadn't stopped it. But um, looked like Kel wanted it more to me. Yeah. I mean, I know how close you were with Ricky Hatton. Yeah. I know you're a massive boxing fan. I was actually around Ricky Hatton's filming last week, and he said that that picture of you, you guys, in the, in the ring was yeah. his favourite ever picture. Yeah, in yeah. Yeah, it's his best night of his life. Yeah. Um, and ours too, you know, to be to carry Ricky's belts out at a big fight in Vegas was like a trip for us, you know what I mean? Yeah. And um, yeah, we've known Ricky for a long time and you know he was a city fan and we're city fans and all that. And when he came up and he beat Costa Zoo, it's a great, great, great night. And um, you know, he's a good lad, Ricky. And Campbell's coming through too. Yeah, well, yeah, Ricky's got a few good lads coming through, so yeah, it's all good for him at the minute. Where does that one rank amongst the best fights that you've seen in person? This one? Yeah. yeah this oh, yeah, right up there. Thing. Yeah, right up there. I've seen some belters, but... Because nobody was calling that on the way in. I mean, no, nobody was calling it out. It was good. No, nobody knew how it was going to go, and you, you didn't know whether it was going to be cagey, and either of them didn't want to get beat, so they came not to lose. Kel came to win. Came to knock him out. As a live performer yourself, when you're sat ringside at a fight, do you get like, that goosebump sick feeling? I get more nervous for that for that than I do for myself because yeah. I'm in control of what I do. Yeah. But I get nervous for for other people when they're doing it because yeah. it's like you know you don't know how it's going to go and you have to sit there and watch it unfold. But I'm the glad in the football as well because you know them guys. You know a lot of them guys at City as well. Well, uh, yeah. Get well. I, yeah, today was a bad day at the football, and of course. Did you go to it? Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> and because uh, I'm quite recognisable as a City fan, I got all the, the abuse afterwards. I was getting abuse there from a lot of Liverpool fans. So, yeah. uh, but it was, a, it was a nice end to a bit of a crap day. Though. I really appreciate the time.